Hello students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting video, I would like to tell you something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, pause the video, note it and proceed on. If you find somewhere difficulty, then please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. This is the question. An object is placed beyond the center of curvature capital C of the given concave mirror if the distance of the object is small d1 from C and the distance of the image formed is d2 small d2 from C. The radius of curvature of this mirror is here we have given four options. Option A 2d1 d2 upon d1 minus d2 all d is in uh, small letter. Option B, 2 D1 D2 upon D1 plus D2. Option C, D1 D2 upon D1 plus D2. And option D, D1 D2 upon D1 minus D2. And this question is asked, J means 2021. Now, let us first we have to understand what the question says. Here, we have given a concave mirror. This is center of curvature, denoted capital C. And this is pole and the distance from the pole to center of curvature that is radius of curvature. Okay. Here beyond C object is kept and its image as we know that image is formed between pole and center of curvature. Okay. This is AB. This is A dash, B dash. And the distance of this object from C that is given D1 and the distance of image from C that is given D2. Okay. Now, here we have to find out the radius of curvature. Okay. We have discussed all the informations according to the diagram. As we know that 1 upon f mirror formula is equal to 1 upon v plus 1 upon q. Now, what is the distance from this uh, image that is total distance is r and d2 is minus. So, v is equal to r minus d2. And what is u? That is r plus d1. And here, as we know that f equal to for the concave mirror the focal length is negative so here we know that minus r by 2 so all values we have put in this uh, formula reciprocal that become minus 2 by r all distances minus because uh, distance measured from the pole opposite direction of the ray so therefore take a negative so here r minus d2 that is negative minus 1 upon r plus d1 okay so here minus 2 by r minus common here r minus d2 r plus d1 here r plus d1 plus r minus d2 minus minus cancel 2 by r is equal to here r r that is 2r plus d1 minus d2 here r minus d2 r plus d2 transposing to the left side so here 2 into bracket r minus d2 r plus d1 and multiply cross multiply that is become 2 r square r d1 r d2 bracket close so here now open the bracket by multiplying r square r d1 now d2 multiply with this bracket so minus r d2 and minus d1 d2 is equal to 2 r square 
R D1 minus R D2. Now multiply by 2, then 2R square, 2R D1, 2R D2, 2D1 D2 is equal to 2R square, R D1 minus R D2. Okay? Now, this 2R square, 2R square cancel out. Now, 2R D1 and transposing this uh, R D1 to the left side and subtract it, now it become R D1. Okay? Now, minus 2R D2 and uh, this minus the R D2 transposing to the left side now become plus. So, here minus 2 minus 2 R D2 plus R D2 that is minus R D2. Okay. And now this uh, minus 2 D1 D2 transposing to the right side become 2 D1 D2. Here R get common D1 D2 minus and 2 D1 D2. So R is equal to 2 D1 D2 upon D1 minus D2. That is correct answer. I hope so. You understood this question. Thank you for staying till the end of this video. Definitely, when you will become success, whole contribution goes to your hard work. But if my videos, my lectures, my questions will help in your success, I will consider myself lucky. Please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you once again. Take care. Bye-bye.